Good morning, YouTube. I'm up now. I'm up. I'm about to have me some coffee, start my morning routine, and you already know I'm up, but I'm up. I'm up, but I'm not up, but like I'm up, you know? <laughs> I'm back. Yeah, right, so I'm gonna start you're out there, do what you will. Right in three the things is what I'm grateful for. Word of the Lord. So. And it reads, in the beginning, God created the day the one. And the earth. Today is. And the earth was without form and void. What's today? And July. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the waters. I actually read more than I needed because I really want the first four Oh, words. today the 24th. So, July 24th. In the beginning, God. That's what I'm going to talk about tonight. In all the right. beginning. Three things I'm grateful for. One, two, That's all. Three. In the beginning, God. Let's pray. Let's pray waking up this God morning. I'm grateful for waking up this morning. As we dig into your word, let it be made flesh in us in a supernatural way that we might extract from this word those truths that are relevant not only to the historical context and the continuity of scripture itself, but specifically uh, to I'm the woman, for like what it is we need for the times that we are in right now. Having a roof over my head. For being God enough and good enough. If you were God enough and not good enough, we still couldn't have it. But because you're God and a good God, we believe you for things that are absolutely amazing beyond human comprehension, staggering for us okay. to understand and yet comforting for us to believe. Now drop us down into the depths of your word and baptize us in the revelation of your spirit and let us rise up walking in the newness of life in a new year with a new walk and a new talk and a new attitude. We are going back to the beginning again. In Jesus' sweet and righteous name we pray. Amen. I come in. You shout amen to type amen. Put someone on their emoji. If they got an emoji, pray amen or hallelujah. But say something I, to my say let it be so. Affirmations. In the beginning, God. We are in the book of Genesis, which is part of the Pentateuch, which was written by Moses for the most part. Him by revelation of God. As Moses represents I am the generation of people who have been in working. Egypt for 400 years, actually 430 years. I Moses has spent most of talented. his life in Egypt and, and many of his years in exile away I from Egypt because he has taken things in his own hands beautiful. and tried to bring about justice in his own way and ended up exiled and having to stay in Jethro's house until the burning bush appears unto him and God shows himself to Moses. All right, I got a pen today. God shows himself and says, I am God. And after I pen my day, I'm going to write my journal and Moses get ready for the journey. He is not married. This is what I'm wearing to the gym. Everything. It's our custom to stand for the reading of the word of God. It always like Jesus, because Jesus will upset sin. This is the Jesus who broke the rules. 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 Who turned over tables in the sanctuary. It's not the convenient, quiet, polite Jesus. This is the radical Jesus who ignored the sanctimonious disapproval of the scribes. Didn't conform to the Pharisees. Nor did he acquiesce. To the Sadducees, he was in a class all by himself. And wherever he went, he disrupted things. Think about how Jesus would upset a city or See all that black? That's mad Negro. And, 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 and I'm never covering my hair again because color breaks out my hair. I should have been there my lesson before I went to college and school. I used to experience rain, all types of stuff in my hair. 
Well, you don't want to come in here, right? You don't want to experience. Got to make sure my butt looks bigger than yesterday. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to braid it. That bun got to look big. That bun got to look big. That bun got to look big. I'm sorry, guys. You have to switch your phone another way. I'm recording from my phone. This trust the journey. I'm going to get a uh, uh, goddamn. I'm going to get a goddamn camera soon, but. Just stick with me, okay? High quality for come soon. It's got to be there for me. With the butt, butt looking bigger than yours. Sure do. Now I'm going to just twirl it. So it's going to get like a little not bun. No ass bun. No ass bun. It's going to be a cute little ass man. Little ass bun I ain't going to like. I love the little bun. Little buns with the scrunchie. You can't even tell if I had a little bun. 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 You know, it's got the edges out. You feel me? I'm doing my hair this week. I got to admit, admit that I'm so into you. Yeah, you know, y'all coming with me too, so. I want to see how I'm going to eat it, so I got you. Especially until the sun burns. It was a smelly place. It was a diseased place. It was an infectious place. It was a place where people hung out who had little hope. Yeah. They were afflicted and there were no hospitals that could cure them, no medication that could rectify it, and they were all complicated around this particular area so that people could go to I don't like doing my own little problem. I should have just let's go get it. Because people don't want to leave y'all. I'm just work with that. What I have. No, I can talk to me today. They really love you until something's wrong with you. I can do it. I'm going to talk to my mom today. They really love you until you become difficult to deal with. They really love you as long as you got off your call. But when you start smelling a little bad, people don't want to deal with you. They want to put you off. I don't know why I go to the gym with these fancy ass edges knowing they're going to sweat out with it. Oh, I know they're going to sweat out. Playing with their fancy edges. This bun gonna look bigger like going on, but this is the little bun for the gym. I don't care. Be back. I'm back, beauties. Oh. <laughs> nah. You know what just happened? All right. So it was like a truck in front of me. The truck was about to bust a turn, and I'm still driving. I was just driving and recording. You see? That's why I need a tripod, cause. Me holding my phone while I'm driving is dangerous. But I'm on my way to the gym right now. Yo, before I left the house, I took a uh, a fish oil pill. I did some research about like fish oil and it has a lot of benefits. So let's see if I can get the benefits. You feel me? It's beneficial. Let me see what it do to the body. It's beautiful out here. This is what you call nice weather. The other day it was like 91, 92, 99. That's humid. That's that's the weather that get upset because it's hot. But right now, 82, it feels nice. You feel a Carolina breeze. Take it out to eat. Nah. <laughs> the breeze feels nice or whatever. 
Hi. Y'all gonna see me at the gym. I'll be back. What's up, you two? So I just made it to the gym. My boyfriend's inside and he left his phone at the house charging. So I'm guessing if he wanted me to bring his phone or leave his phone there. I don't know, but we about to see him. Like, why are you leaving your phone at home? You know, I know what he was doing, but why are you leaving your phone at home? Let me clock in. Good going with his phone. Uh, so I started to sell on the machine. I'm about to do some editing while I'm on the machine. I'm gonna get some work for work done. Damn, I'm supposed to be stretching and I forgot to stretch. <laughs> That's why you be sore, like. So I already did 20 minutes on this machine. We about to go work out these abs and this ass. Right, I gotta clean it first, you know? Clean it. You don't have to, but it's better if you do it so everything could be clean. You know, I'm about to get the, the hip seduction. About to get right on this machine. I swear, this is the machine I always have me sore because I don't stretch. My legs be so sore to open up. What's up, you two? I'm back. <laughs> I'm always back with it, like, back with another one. But um, I just came from the gym. I'm about to make me some breakfast. I'm making um, turkey bacon, eggs, uh, avocado toast, and oatmeal. So I'm going to have something healthy. You feel me? Weezy out of here. I know the avocado is mad brown. It's because when air hits the avocado, it starts changing colors, so that's why. Yeah. I'm eating like I'm pregnant today. Looks goody, beauties. So I'm on my way to my client house right now. Yo, I ate like oatmeal, egg, table tots. I was being real hungry. And I'm full, I'm tired. And I try to force myself to get up and stay productive. So that's what I'm doing right now. Staying productive, getting this money, you already know. Your girl is stuck. I play myself trying to eat all that, but like, I should have just been fasting. It would have been good. I feel like I want to nap. I don't know why food makes you so tired. I'm, I'm, I'm real tired. I know not to do that tomorrow. I ain't going to eat and just head out. My, my stomach's on F. Full. Shit on E is F. and I'm gonna really do your hair.
How you doing? Hello. I'm doing good. Come here, on so. in. Forgive the burnt smell. My daughter tried to make it wrong. But they didn't have me any shorter than 52. Is that okay? It's okay. 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 Yes, I did two of them. All right. What matters is that you got three bundles. Okay. <laughs> okay. I just finished doing my client here. You know, I already slayed it. I'm going to insert the video so you guys can see. The day is not over yet, so stay tuned, bitches. <laughs> Weezy out of here. What's up, YouTube? So I'm about to start this. I'm about to kill that fly. I'm about to go shake. And this keep on the camera. Where's that? Where's that? Where's that? Where's that? See you. I'm back with another one. You already know I'm about to pose, 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 pose. You about to do a triangle haul. Boom, I'm about to vote for y'all bitches. <laughs> Don't for me, 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 don't for me